Hi, this is Miss McPhee, and it is Thursday, September 12th, 2019. This is our first homework video uh, for the year. So welcome to my Math 6 students. You've been doing really an excellent job. I enjoy seeing you every day after lunch and in the afternoon. And we started our unit this week on area. And we've been decomposing shapes and rearranging them to look at unique areas and how we can problem solve to find them. So I did go to the shoebox for this week's homework that you received Monday and that's due tomorrow. And there was a question about could we do the third problem. So sure, a maritime flag is shown. What's the area of just the shaded part of the flag? Explain or show your reasoning. So the first thing I notice is that none of this is shaded. So I'm just gonna get rid of it completely. I'm not even gonna look at it anymore. In fact, I'm gonna take my index card and just cover it up. So now we have this shaded region. So I'm starting with a rectangle. And I'm gonna find that area. And then I'm gonna subtract this piece that I don't need. So I'll say minus that triangle. And that's gonna give us just the shaded region. So let's find the area of the rectangle. Well, we have one side that measures eight inches and one side that measures six plus six inches. So that's really a total of 12 inches. So the whole area is 96 inches squared, but we need to subtract this piece that we're not using. So we looked this week at how we can kind of use um, some tracing paper. And we noticed that if we have this triangle, and we use our tracing paper, and we trace, and we move it up here. That's our, that's our bell for change of class, but you're already in related arts. What we end up with is this rectangle here that we're not gonna use. So we took this triangle here, and we moved it up. So now what we have is this side here that was six inches, and then we have this side here, which they mention at the bottom, is four inches. So that area of that space that we're not gonna need, because we took those two triangles and rearranged them to make a rectangle, has an area of four times six. And four times six is 24. So we're gonna subtract 96, which is that whole rectangle, minus 24, which is this space that we're not gonna need, and that's how we get 72 inches squared. We're gonna keep working with area this week and next week. Um, our next lesson is gonna look at parallelograms, which are slightly different than the rectangles we've been looking at, but you're gonna take the same strategies we've been using and apply them. Thank you for your hard work. Um, hope these videos help you throughout the year, and I'm looking forward to our time together. Bye.